All right. Welcome everybody. I'm going to do something a little bit different today. All right. Welcome everybody. All right. So, as you can tell, not playing well. Not today. Uh, we're going to play a little bit of uh, Atlas. I'm going to go through Atlas real quick. Uh, show you guys the beginning areas and stuff. Give me just a second here. I'm kind of setting everything up. I haven't done a whole lot of what I'm trying to do here. Alright, so I am level one. Louis Nine Toes. I am at a free port. So um our first objective <laughs> is to get a ship and get the hell out of here. So we That's kind of the tedious part. I gotta get wood. So we're gonna kind of basically run through what you need to do to get started. And we'll go for the, through the first few levels. So first thing you do, obviously you need a tool. Uh, if I open up my crafting menu, right now I've got nothing. I, I can't do a thing, but I'm about to level up. So in the meantime, I'm going to gather some fibers. And there's my first level. So, we're going to put that in weight, actually. Yeah. And so I got three points to spend. Obviously, you want to start with, uh, you need your tools so you can get hatchet, stone, pick, torch, and then your cloth stuff. And then you need a weapon right off the bat. So you need to go there. And then I'm not going to spend this other point yet. So uh, I need to go pick up some stones. There we go. Now I can make a pickaxe. Okay, so I got a pickaxe, which is going to help us out, so that's going to, now I need to get some flint and wood to get a spear. Okay, I got wood, and then I'm going to come in here and... Craft me a couple spears. I can only craft one. What else do I need? Oh, I need some more wood. And another one. Let's see if I can turn the gamut down just a little bit. Holy crap. 
Okay, now that I got a spear. Wow, that turned it down way too much. There we go. Now the first thing to do is to go after something easy. Like a chicken. What I'm going for is the skin. Because I need hide to make it. Ooh. Okay, so if you're lucky, this is a shipwreck. Uh, maybe there's still something salvageable here. Maybe not, but if there is, it's free mats. And it was a it was a ramshackle, so you don't get any materials off of it. Oh well, it was worth a shot. I scavenge. I scavenge all the time. I don't have any problem with it. <laughs> okay, uh, we're gonna kill a turtle. Okay, so now we have a really good start. Um, I need to go get a little bit more wood, but I'm going to spin that. Um, I have four points, so I'm actually going to go... <sighs> do I want to do... Yeah, I'm going to do archery. So I can craft a bow and arrow. So we're gonna go ahead and I need uh I need twenty two wood. But there's a method here. There's a method of my madness. I'm gonna get some wood so I can actually make a hatchet first. I'm gonna drop this stuff because I'm not gonna be able to it'll rot before I can use it. So yeah, there's a timer on meat. It rots after a while. It, all food does. So basically those spears are going to be useless. Well, I'll still use them though. Okay, so now that I got a hatchet. Now I'm getting wood. But I gotta watch my weight. If you look over in the corner, you can see the the scale um, underneath the XP. That's saying that I'm fairly weighted right now. Um, but your object, your your goal is to build a ship and get at, see. Oh my gosh! Look at all the shipwreck. If any of that's good stuff, I might be in trouble because I don't have stamina to uh or the see I can I can do a raft right now but I really want the to get the ramshackle sloop. Um I'm actually gonna dive and see if there's anything salvageable here that I can actually use. Uh, this happens when people leave their ships here. No, these are all ramshackle. You can't salvage them, they're not good for anything. Yeah, I can tell that because I'm not getting any materials off of them, so there's three of them here. Oh wait, there's a box there. Somebody left me a present. Right, I'm going to get the stamp sale out of the way. Okay, see what we got here. I'm going to probably be encumbered. Oh yeah, all kinds of stuff. Okay. So now I'm encumbered, I'm overweight, but hopefully there's enough material here. Um, what do we got? We'll look at it here. I don't use torches. But I got some good stuff though, I got some thatch, lots of hide, some metal. Metals, it's weighing me down. It's 33 pounds. Uh, well, the wood is too. Um, I'm going to 
try to get myself over here. See what else we need to get in Ramshackle Sloop. So yeah, this is a new series I want to try to do. Uh, tonight I'm just going to make it uh, pretty much to level 8 for the server area. Um, and it's a live, this is a live broadcast. Uh, many of the other ones that I do will probably just be recorded because there's a lot of downtime in, in Atlas. There's a lot of farming and just traveling and, sh you know, stuff that isn't very exciting. Okay, so I'm short on fiber and wood. I got plenty of hide. Um, I've got some good stuff. I don't want to lose any of it right now. Ah. Get up there. Jump. There we go. But I've got to get rid of something because I'm, I'm too heavy right now. Um, I'm going to get rid of the spear. Because I won't need that. See the fibers I need. Flint I can always get more of. Um, and the same with the stone. Stone, oh my gosh, that's 43 pounds. There we go. Now I'm not overweight anymore. What did I say? I need fiber and ah, damn it, fiber and wood, I think. So I'm going for this one right here. So I need about 10 fiber and about 50 wood. Okay, that's easy. I'll have my first ship here in a second. I just gotta get to it. Jump, 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 jump. Ah, I won't let me jump over there. Bastard. Okay. Okay, so that's all the fiber I need. I'm not gonna get, I'm, I'm gonna need more, but Right now I'm just concentrating on exactly what I need so I don't get over encumbered again. Like that. Damn it. Because <laughs> uh, I can't jump. So. But I got exactly what I need. Hey. Dude. Elephant. Lay off, dude. Problem is if you're in a free port and you die, you lose your stuff. There is no going back. So, we're already doing really good. Come on, hop up, hop up. There you go. Buggy piece of crap. <laughs> look at that, I can actually keep my stone in my... F look at that. <laughs> See how much more slow now, though? Doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo. Okay, so now I can buy the Ramshackle Sloop. I'm going to go and buy it. I'm going to name it. Oh, what the hell. I'm going to name it Snarf. Snarf. <laughs> okay, so let's go check it out. This is your beginning beginner boat. It's a lot better than a raft. It's got two sails, so it's a little bit difficult. Don't drop down into there, um, or you will be stuck. And it would suck. So it's got two styles. It's kind of tricky to operate by yourself, but it's doable. So my next, I need to make a bed. So I need to go some more fiber and wood. Beds are very important. If you die, you can respawn at your bed, no matter where you are. And that is the goal here is to survive. And part of that is dying every once in a while. Whoa, what the, oh, you jerk. Freaking manta ray. So yeah, when a free port, nothing attacks except for sea life. Manta rays and sharks will attack you. Doesn't make any sense, but whoops. I didn't want to hit that bull. He'll come whoop my ass. Okay, that should be enough wood. See, right now I'm just gathering as I need it. Because I'm not high enough level, and my weight carrying load is really, really low. Okay, so now I can make a bed. 
as soon as I level. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and drop that on my hotbar real quick. As soon as I level, I should be able to make a chest. Um, I'm going to make a bow and arrow real quick. Well, the bow and then the arrows, obviously. And that'll lower some of my weight, so that'll help me out. There we go, see? And then I want to make some arrows. How many can I make? One. What do I need? I am missing some fibers. So let's gather some fiber real quick. We need some, because we're going to need some more hide. Because we need clothes. We need to get some clothes before we leave here. Um, I am, let's see where I'm at in the map. I just picked a random spot. So I'm in A6, which is one of my favorite places to be. Um, after that, we'll, we'll come over to somewhere else and try to find some land. It's not very easy, but we'll, we'll try to find something. We might even do it in the lawless zone if we have to. Lawless zones... So you have three major zones. You have a, a free port, which is where we're at. You can't build here. You can't claim land. You can't do anything. Uh, you can start, and you can you can do basic stuff. So I just leveled. So I'm gonna increase my weight again. Um, I believe I want I want the construction tab, which will unlock up here. And then, uh, that's four wood. Storage box. Uh, that's the little one. I don't want the little one, though. See, that's what I want right there. So... This is the one I want, right here, Secrets of Building. So for now, I'm just going to take... So that takes two, four, five. So Okay, so we're just going to do... Secrets of Building for now. The goal is to get this one right here because that's the large large storage box. So until then, uh, we'll gather some stuff up. Not too much, because I'm almost out of... Okay, um, arrows, arrows, there we go. I can make 52 arrows, we don't need that many. Let's go with 20. There we go. Okay, now I got some arrows. And I don't want to kill cows because then the bulls will come after me and then it's no bueno. Get up there. Up. Ah. Up, 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 up. Thank you. Okay, but we do want to go over to our boat and... We want to go somewhere else because we don't need to be here. Get on the ladder. Thank you. Holy shit. Hey, Wild well, Freak, what's going on, bud? Okay, so uh, I'm doing this solo. So, like I said, don't fall down in there. You'll be screwed. So, I'm only going to use one sail for now. I gotta be a little careful because I said I'm by myself and I don't want to fall down in that hole. If I fall down in that hole, then I'm screwed. I probably, 
pretty much just need to kill myself. Because you get stuck. So I'm going to open sale to about 30%. Let's take it nice and easy. I can't get too crazy. I don't have a crew with me, so I have to control everything. Um, if I was higher level and came to a starter zone, I would tear down those sails and build new ones. <laughs> it's going to be quite a while before I can build anything like that. So this is this is a little bit something different from my level 50 that I that I have. My stuck. Come on, dude. Throw me a bone here. I might go out of control here. So I want to go that way. And I got to find some stuff to kill because I got to get some levels. Because that's how you, you start building stuff is you get levels. You put your points into them. There's lots of skill trees. <clears throat> I gotta find an, a place where I can actually kill stuff and not get killed. You know what I mean? I see up there in the corner where the arrow is pointing down. That's where, that's where the wind's going. So I need to rotate my sail as much this way to try to catch some of the wind. See how that bottom circle kind of turned green a little bit? That means it's got some air. And there we go. See, now we're moving. I'm going to get out of this cove because I don't need to be here. If I was in open sea, I could use, I can, I'd probably open up my other sail too. But I'm not, so we're we're just taking our time. Nice cruise going on here. I go find some stuff to kill. Yeah, the wind's not being very generous with this right now. not being very kind. There's a little, they, they've given us a little bit of forgiveness with the wind. Uh, if I turn my sail directly to the wind, we'll actually be able to move a little bit. I don't know how that works, but it works. See, we're actually moving a little bit. We're just in a really bad spot right now. Um, so yeah, your your first like four levels, three levels, they just give you, and they're like super quick. And if you notice now, I'm still gaining the XP like sixty point five, point six. point seven because <laughs> I'm not actually running or doing anything if I got out of the boat and was running around that would increase it a little bit but I wanted to get my my little okay I need a little bit more see I'm... that hole bugs me Come on, you can do it, you can do it. You can do it, little boat. There's a ray down there. A couple cows right here, I think. Okay, so here's a trick. If you're going, jump out of your boat. Ta -da! It automatically stops it and throws down the anchor if you're in shallow enough water. <laughs> Real helpful if you're soloing a two-mast ship. Okay, so 
I'm gonna get some easy kills here. If I can hit it. Okay, maybe not. That might not have been a good idea. Oh! Got the bull. Ah, uh, cow ran away. It's alright, we got the bull though. That was a good little chunk of XP. Get my arrows back. And then we're gonna drag the. I can't drag them. So I'll just use the axe to. I don't really care about the meat. I'm going after the leather. And I'll cook up some of the meat. I can make a fire, can't I? Yep. Campfire. See, that gave us a huge, that gave us like 25 XP. So when you're actually doing stuff, <laughs> I'm gonna try to get that fish. There we go. You want to do fish because they give you uh, the blue vitamin, which you need. <sighs> Heat water. See, that's why you pick it up. <laughs> there we go. The big freaking fish. All right. So now that I got some. So if you look over in the corner of the very top bar, you got yellow, pink, orange, and blue. Those are your vitamin levels. And to keep them somewhat balanced. Okay, so I have a bed. So I'm going to go ahead and come up here and I'm going to put it down. Probably right about there. So now if I die, that's where I spawn. Uh, I just made a fireplace. Let's see, you hear me moaning. I'm freaking hungry. So there's my fireplace. Um, we're gonna put all the meat in there and we will cook it up. Ah, screw it. We'll just put all of it in there. But then I've also got some veggies that I can eat. Oh, I got prime meat too. Let's let's cook it all up. I gotta make sure I got room. And if you don't eat, if you don't cook or eat anything for meat-wise, it turns into rotten meat, which is useful later for certain things, but. I don't need it right now. Um, I do have some veggies, so I'm going to eat some. Because I am hungry. I'm starving. Okay. So I got some cooked fish meat. Um, I got some cooked prime animal meat. So we're going to go ahead and eat those real quick. Let's see, my vitamins go up, but my the one I'm looking at is my stomach icon. That's the one I'm really worried about. Okay. So let's keep going. I need to get out of here, then I need to run back, and I need to go get some water. So... Free zone, there's always a like a pond that you can go to to get water. Or you can dig it, dig in the ground, and I'll show you how to do that here in a second. They really like their little mini games in this freaking game. So 
So if you're a normal follower of Wuso Horty, uh, obviously this is not World of Warcraft. <laughs> Um, I will be doing a series of these videos on YouTube and Twitch. Um, they'll be on Twitch when I'm streaming live like I am right now, and they will just be on YouTube when I record a video. So I'm going to try to mix it up a little bit. Uh, I said this is a game with a lot of grinding and a lot of downtime, so it's not always exciting stream material. Come on, man. I'm going to die of thirst if I don't get out of this freaking area. Sometimes if you just go back and forth. this The wind is not... I, I wasn't expecting this. I might just have to hop out and run over there real quick and get some water. Uh, the fourth icon down on the left lower hand corner. Or right lower hand corner, sorry. The uh, water droplets set your water rate obviously uh, mine's extremely low somebody's over there chopping trees down and then you get your stomach and then that's your stamina is the lightning bolt and then your overall health um, I should be leveling here any second now, to be honest with you. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump out right here. I'm going to continue to let my food cook. Nobody can mess with my stuff. Um, I, I am on a PvE server. I'm not going to even try to stream on a PvP server. I'm not that dumb. Okay, so with this, you have to lay down on the ground, click your button. Then you get this little freaking mini game that blows. Ah, see, so I only get 20 freaking water. But that'll keep me alive for a little while. If you do that three times, you get 20 water each time. Alright, alright, okay, so I still got a spear, so I'm going to go use it real quick. Um, I saw a chicken over here. Chicken! Go kill another chicken! Oh, see, now I leveled up. Let's go ahead. I put it all in weight. So now I need, see, my goal is to come down here. So, and I only have three points. So I'm going to do those. Oh, I could do a... I can do a small storage box if I really wanted to, but that would be a waste right now. Um, yeah, let's just keep it at that. Next level, I will be able to make. So I'm not going to get a fight a ski seagull because they fly and then I'll kill me. Well, we'll go after turtle. I got to use the spear. And chop them up. There's another turtle here. Where'd you go, turtle? You went away. Okay, but I do need to start thinking about making clothes. Let's go ahead and queue all these up and uh, that'll lower my weight a little bit because nine times out of ten the crafted item weighs less than the individual components that makes sense and you do have a respec every level so you can respec um, I know exactly what I'm going for, so. And, yeah. Um, I have seven arrows. I'm going to make three more. 
I always want to make sure I have ammunition and stuff. There's the turtle. Now my spear might break. I'm going to have to back off and then switch to my bow. Yep. Or I can punch him. There we go. I'm almost leveled up again. So with this, you can only level up to level 8 in a free port. So my goal is to be able to have what I need and get the heck out of here as soon as possible. Pick up some more stones. I might need them. By the time I get back to my boat, I should be pretty close to leveling again. How am I doing? Oh, so close. So close. I need that level. Okay. Let's put my bow back in my hotbar here. Unless there's a 10 second cooldown from the time that you place it in there. Um, I don't see any bulls around here. Now I might not kill it, but I'll get experience for doing damage. See? Ah, you moved. Let's see if I can chase it down and kill it. I'm, I... What? I'm hit. Oh, you're, you're crap. You're absolute garbage. No, I didn't want to. Son of a gun. I didn't want to do that. But I leveled. So now, that is what I want right there. So now I need, because I want I need to make one of those. So I need fiber and wood. Screw you, cow. Okay, so there's the wood. Get some fibers. I'm overweight right now, but I won't be here in a second. Can I make it yet? There we go. Large storage box. And while I'm at it, I want to make a wood ceiling. So I need a little bit more wood. That hole that we were talking about in my my little boat there, we're going to cover that up. So that I don't have to worry about falling down the damn thing again. Because it sucks. So there's my storage box. And then there's that ceiling. All right, let's get back to the boat. We'll get it ready. Notice I am level six, almost ready to leave this freaking horrible island. I hate free zones. Let's turn the gamma up. There we go. That just makes it a little bit easier to see. Especially with old man eyes like mine. All right. So first things first, now if I really want to get creative, I could spend more time here and I can modify this boat, this little sloop here, but I'm not going to worry about it because I don't plan on having this thing for very long. Okay, so we're going to put the storage box right there. We'll go there and guess what? 
everything's empty. I'm free! Yay! Let's go ahead and get rid of that, too. Alright, it's like starting over. Let's go ahead and turn that off. I don't want to waste my wood. And then I've got some cooked meat in here, so... Um, how am I doing? So you gotta be careful eating meat, especially the cooked prime, because... You want to try to keep your, think your uh, vitamins balanced because you get a buff. See right here? Plus melee damage multiplier 20, 42, 30, speed multiplier 10%. So as long as you keep, and I'm not really balanced, but they're giving me the buff, so I'm not going to complain about it. Level 17 Ray, holy cow. That might be some good experience here. Ah, he got unstuck. Damn it. He was stuck in my boat for a while. But my hatchet's about to break, so I need to go get some, uh... I don't have enough... I'm gonna go get some wood. Do 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 do. You gotta plan stuff out when you're doing stuff. So, my hatchet's broke, which is fine. I just mean, so we gotta get stuff to fix it. And one of those things is uh, hide, which I have it on the boat, but I can get it easy enough. Uh, I need some flint. Make a whole bunch of arrows here. Uh, my bow has got 29 durability left, or uh, 19 durability left. Okay, so kill us a turtle. Then I got my arrows back. <laughs> now, since the hatchet is still in my hotbar, I can actually push number two and it would repair it. Or I can come, I can open up the window, left click, and repair. If you scroll over it, it tells you what materials you need to repair. So we're going to go ahead and repair it. <coughs> now we're going to drop this meat because we're not going to need it. Remember, weight is a, uh, a key thing right here. Okay. Continue killing stuff to get some XP. Um, I want this fish. I saw this fish down here. Ah, oh, you bass. You bass. I want that bass. I don't know if I can do it with three arrows. Holy crap, look how fast he's regenerating health. You jackass. I want that because I want the oil. Oil's very help helpful later on. Okay, so level 7. Let's see what we can learn. Um, we're just doing useful stuff right now. Yeah, it's a good time to come back here and just dump all this stuff. We'll put the arrows back in our... There we go. And that's meat we can get rid of. We don't need to carry that much meat. And uh, same with that. Because it, it'll spoil before we could use it. So. 
again in weight I put everything in weight for quite a while um, if, if you're in a cold environment you want to put it all in fortitude but so um, a little too early to be getting into seamanship But I want to be able to make metal tools. So that, let me find it here. I think it's in this first one here. Yeah. So this is the one where you get smithy and stuff. I need eight skill points. So I am going to actually use those points for something else now. And when I level up again, I will respec. That way I can I can make metal tools. So by the time I leave this island, I will be using metal tools and not the crappy ones. So for now, um, I'm actually going to open that up just to see it. I'm not going to use it. <clears throat> I mean, I can buy a tiny, I can do a tiny shipyard. That's, and then, a, well. Ooh, see? That's the regular sloop. That's what I want. Ask her, we're just going to, we're just burning points. But yeah. I mean, that's pretty much, I mean, we're off to a really good start. We haven't died. Um, I'm going to come up and get some more water. Hopefully I do better than I did last time. One, and there's three of these. Damn it. So I'm only getting a third of the, what I could get. Get up. And if I wanted to run all the way over there. I could fill up on water, but I mean, like, there's no penalty for dying, really. Especially since you have a bed, you can just spawn right back at it. Okay, let's find something easy to kill. We want to get that one last level before we leave here um, and make. So yeah, I am actually going to come over here, try to find uh, some metal, so we can get ready to, because I'm going to have to make a smithy. That's crystal, damn, I want some crystal, there we go. I'm just, just a little bit, because it's heavy. That is awesome to have at this very early stage of the game. It's very heavy though. So we're just going to pound on some rocks. Get some metal. Get a ton of flint. We don't need that much flint. Uh, but I will make some more arrows though. Oh, I need fiber. So it's a fun game. I I'm actually I'm enjoying it a lot. Uh, they've made a lot of good fixes. They made some bad fixes. They're they're trying to tune stuff. You got to give them a little bit of time. Uh, we're only a month into this thing. I figure one month out of the first 24 that it's going to be early access. So they are they they they're being very honest about it being a two-year development period. There we go. See. Now we're good on water. Okay, this island. 
get up also has sap I want to get some of this not a whole lot but we want to get as much as I can carry right now which is going to be about a hundred sap is extremely useful later on um, I've got crystal and sap I'm that's a really good start but again I know this island so I know it's here <laughs> that's why I picked this island to start at so we'll come back here we'll unload this stuff that we just picked up gotta be careful not to overload the boat upper left or upper right hand corner it's got a health meter for the boat a weight meter and an XP meter Okay, let's dump those in there. See, staff only stacks at 20, so you gotta be careful. This is all the room I've got. Alright, and you're freaking hungry again. Eventually, you just kill yourself because you get tired of them freaking. Uh, uh. Oh, no, 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 no. No fire. You don't need fire. Um, Cook prime meat. And then you leave them in the fireplace, they actually last a little bit longer. Not too long, too much longer, but a little bit. I have not found any vegetables. That's the vitamin C. Hopefully. Well, the sun needs to come out so I can get some sun. I don't know, that's vitamin D. I've got plenty of vitamin D. That's the uh, blue one. Okay. Uh, I was going to make some arrows with that stuff that I just got. Oh, well. But then I start moaning and groaning about being hungry again. So I got sidetracked. Okay. Now, I know it's super quiet. There's only a couple of people watching. Hopefully, we get more people watching, uh, asking questions. I will answer anything and show off anything. Even, uh, you know, I'll even hop on my, my higher level tune every once in a while and maybe go uh, ship the damn hunting or... I'm actually really considering building another ship with nothing but... Uh, Harpoon launchers on it and seeing if I can go solo hunt some whales. Remember, I gotta be careful of uh, how much stuff I gather because. Um, there we go. Let's go kill something here. Is that a chicken? Oh yeah. I'll kill the chicken. <laughs> oh, poor chicken. One or two more kills. It might give me a level. Logan. We can jet on out of this place, man. Well, almost. We need to stick around just a little bit longer. I need to build my smithy. And then build the tools. And then we can get out of here. Come on. I need something to kill. I gotta be kind of careful. There we go. Right in the ass. And there's my level. So what I'm going to do, put that back into weight. 
I have three points. I don't think I have enough to get to where I want because I need I need that right there and I'm short points. So what I'm going to do real quick, I'm going to spec into the water keeper. Um So I can make a couple water skins. Now see, here's where I can make that paste. So we're gonna do this, okay. Um, I just learned chemistry, or uh, chemicals and tanning. So I need some stone. <sighs> okay. So this turn this took a little bit of a turn here. And this is where some of the the, the grinding comes in. I need to gather up some stone, make a mortal mortar and pedestal, and use that sap to make organic paste. because that is the important critical item for a lot of things. I'm not gonna get carried away with it. I might make just some flaming arrows. They'll come in handy later on. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and make that real quick and then we're gonna get back to the boat. Oh, we need to go get that right there. You see that that uh, mana ray that's dead? That's like free oil. If I can get to it before it despawns. Oh, there's another one. Thank you. Thank you very much, guys. I don't care about the fish meat, I want the oil. Gosh, you are slow. Come on, dude. Take some swimming classes. All right. There's that one. I love it when men are just, they swim up on, sh on a uh, shallow shore or even a rock right here and they die. All right. So that was a good little hull of oil there. That'll help out a lot, a whole, whole lot. I just want to make sure before I leave this island that I'm actually ready to. Alright, so. Um, I'm going to drop this mortar and pedestal. Right here. If you notice uh, above all my action bars, you have reached a maximum level 8 for a free port. You must explore new regions to continue to advance. Yeah, thanks genius, we got that. <laughs> so right now I'm not getting any experience at all. I'm dropping all this stuff. Um, so we're going to do that and then we're going to take all the... I don't want any more than I have to carry. Um, and I think flint, right? And, um, fiber, fibers, I need fibers, okay. There we go, I got fiber, I got fiber. 
So we're going to make all organic paste. So right now I can make 105. Um, while that's doing it, let's see, how much metal do I have? 54. I'm seeing what I can make. Eh, I'm not going to worry about water skin because you don't really don't need it. I don't need a loom because there's nothing I can really make with it right now. I mean, if I was... I don't need that until I get down to... Mm, let's see. Right there. Speed sale. So it's it's quite a bit. And I don't... Yeah. It's going to be a while before I can get there. So I don't need to make a loom. Oh, there's another one. Pardon me? So even though this is PvP, this is still a game of opportunity. When you see an opportunity, you take it. I am a huge scavenger. You will probably see me more than once diving for for stuff. Look at that, I've already got 53 freaking oil, so I'm doing really good on oil actually. Still making it, still, okay. Um, and then, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna load up on arrows. Um, ch -ch 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 wood. My flint's in here. So, right now I can't make, I need that right there, Secrets of the Bow. So the next time I level, I will put my first point in there, I'll make all the flame arrows that I can, right? And then I'll respec out of it. Actually, I should. There's nothing else I need, so I'm going to go ahead and respec. Okay. So I'm at level one right now. Um, I'm going to actually. Let's see. Bring that up to 300. And then I'm going to give myself a little bit of fortitude here. Alright, so remember my goal. So I need the I need that one. Oh, I needed that one. I don't need that. I needed this one. This is the one I wanted. There we go. Okay. And then we needed the archery. I think I just messed up. Yep, yeah, because I can't make the... Damn it. Oh, well. That's all right. It'll, that'll, that'll get fixed very, very quickly. But right now we are just going for survivability. I don't need that yet. I really don't. So we're just going to go with being able to survive. So I want to be able to make more bow and arrows if I need to. That's thatch. I don't really care about thatch. I just do survivability stuff. See, but the thing is, I can do a smithy and I can do the tools. And that was my main... So, you know what? Honestly, that's all I really care about right now. 
So let's put everything in my inventory. I know it'll encumber me. Um, I'm going to equip my gear that I got. And when you respec it, it like, takes it all away. Okay. Um, Smithy, I need fibers. Oh, you know what? I have fibers right there. There's the fiber. Um, there we go. I'm gonna make this smithy. Hi, Bridget. How you doing, hun? I am just messing around and uh, playing some Atlas. This is the beginning of a new character. I'm going to maybe possibly do a series of these. If I can get some people to watch. <laughs> ah, i got to find a place to put this. That's going to be out of the way. The problem with a small ship like this, everything's in the way. So I'm just going to slap it down. Change. There we go. That makes it easier. I wish I could put it right there, but it's not going to fit. Maybe I can put it back here. So I've got to get to those sails and quickly. I put it right in this corner right here, I think. And I can still get to the ladder. Or not. Set out a gun. That would be a dumb place to put it because my steering wheel is right there. Could put it right there, I just have to go around it. Nice, good Bridget. Yeah, I just trying to get something new going and uh this is a game that I know about, so and I enjoy playing, so why not? Right? If it doesn't work out then oh well. Right there. Aha. Alright, now I got a smithy. Let's dump everything I got into it. And that's extra storage. So, with the crystal I got, I can make a spyglass, which is the first thing I'm gonna make because it's the hardest thing to make. That makes sense. And then that way I now have enough materials. So we've got a metal hatchet, a metal pick, a metal sickle, They're just so much better. They last longer. They and they harvest more material each time you use it. And that's about it. That's yeah. I'm ready to roll. Um, my weight looks good. I'm gonna drop some of this. So yeah, I think I am ready to get off this island. They're out of this zone anyway. I can't level up anymore here, so there's no use, of, no sense at all in uh, staying around. Come on. So I want to point my boat in the right direction before I open up my sails because I'm doing this all solo. There's another manta ray over there, but I don't care. I got enough. Well, we're just starting out here. And here we go. Don't know where we're going. Um, anywhere right here. Maybe south a little bit. Or we can go north, because that's... Looks like that's where we're going, so... We'll go north, which gives me a really bad feeling, because that's where Destiny had a big foothold on stuff on the PvP server when I first started there. I 
And see, my sloop has already leveled, so uh, to ensure that I do good on traveling, I put everything into weight on this first little ship here. And we are out. See how easy that was? Took me an hour, 70 minutes to level up to level eight, which is the max level for the free zone, um, to build my first little ship with the smithy, metal tools, which is pretty good, and a nice little stockpile of some materials. Go ahead and change the sails here. Um, so not too bad. Um, this is a heck of a lot better than I started when I very first started playing this game. So that's over. Oh no! What happened to the stream? What's going on with the stream? Hello, stream. Looks like it got all choppy all of a sudden. Come on, don't do this to me. It was going so good, too. This freaking game eats up my computer. I swear to God it does. I've got it on low so I can stream. Let's see if that helps at all at any <laughs> sorry about that guys I seem to be doing a little bit better <sighs> hey Wayne how's it going as soon as if I have to the uh, options and stuff open it just like slows the hell out of it. Freaking crazy. I'm doing so good up until I start leaving the area. Jackasses. Oh, let's see, my sloop just leveled again. put that into some more weight because I'm gonna have this sloop for a little while till I can get some materials built up and build a a, uh, a custom sloop I've probably built a dozen of the the ones that I'm thinking of <laughs> it's my design um, it's a design that I saw online and then I kind of uh, tweaked it a little bit Okay, so we are in A5 Lawless Zone. Now, Lawless pretty much means that uh, you can't claim land here, but you can build. Um, it's a little bit higher decay rate, not as high as the free ports, though. Pretty much, you have like three days, I think. Four days. Um, and then your stuff becomes open. Other people can come by and, and demolish it and steal it. Um, I mentioned before, I'm a scavenger. So on my... 
this is North. This is a EU PVE server because on the US side on the PVE server I have my level 50 character. Um, he's actually level 51. I just haven't put his point in yet for reasons. But I'm a scavenger. If I see something's open, you know, and I can take it, I'm gonna take it. I'm a pirate. This is a pirate game. People don't understand that. It's not called stealing. It's called playing the game. You don't want your shit stolen? Take care of it. It's that simple. So, yeah. <laughs> they have a pretty long grace period so that, that you can be offline and not take care of your stuff. Uh, you'll see when we get to the island, I'll show you exactly what I mean. I guarantee you there's going to be ships lined up on this shoreline. They're going to be freaking everywhere. So I'm going to get out and I'm going to adjust my sails just a little bit. Trying to line it up with that white arrow. Now the arrow is the wind direction. Uh, white is good. That means that's, that's the direction you're going. The longer the arrow, the stronger the wind. So we've got pretty decent wind right now. But we're going to go to the first island that we see. Because we want to build our actual sloop that we're going to have for a while. This thing won't last long. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> uh, the issue with building a different sloop is I need a medium speed sail and you need a lot of points to get there. Um, it'll be one of those things where I build up to it just to build it and then I'll respec out of it. Because it is uh, pretty far down. See, I don't, yeah, remember I respec, I don't even have ship building. There's a lot of respecting and thinking, especially when you're playing solo, like I do. There's there's a lot of changing up. Uh, depending on what we find here, I mean, hell, I can't even build any kind of... Not until I level and get to respect. But it shouldn't take me long to level up once I get up here. I'll get a discovery right off the bat. Excuse me. Um... Where do I want to go? I'm gonna go right there. I'm right there. See, there's a ship there. Right over there. Let's look. There's a ship there. See, I was thinking to myself, that's a good place to land. Well, I guess what? other people thought so too. So it's gonna get crowded here. My frame rate might drop. It probably will. So a little trick, remember I mentioned before, especially when you're manning a dual sail ship by yourself, if you jump out, it'll drop your sails. Now I can slowly get to shallow enough water. Um, where that XP is blinking up there, if you look underneath that, a very faint anchor sign will show up there once I can level, or once I can, once I can anchor. Any time now. Maybe. I might have to back up and do it. So, let's drop sails. Um, if I, so on PVE servers, if you jump on someone else's anchored boat, you get stuck on it. So we're not going to do that. Um, so I don't want to back my ladder up to these rafts and I won't be able to get on my own boat. So I'm going to try to angle it just a little bit here. There's a steep drop off right there. I don't know if I'm going to be able to anchor right here. 
people on their damn rafts. Look at all these, yeah. I want, yeah, and see, this is the problem with PV, PVE servers. Yeah, screw this. See all those freaking little boxes all over the place? Those are foundations people place so people can't build. They're everywhere. That's like the most trolly freaking thing you can do. That pisses me off. It's like a complete dick move. If you want to put foundations like that around your own, you know, your base where you're going to build, then do it. You know, I can understand that a little bit, but not everywhere. I'm going to go on this island and you're going to see those little foundations everywhere. You know, when there's not any buildings. Because people just do it to troll. I've said it before, in some ways PvE server is more frustrating than PvP server. Because they control and they can get away with it. There's no repercussions. At all. Devs don't give a shit. Alright, I'm going to see if I can sneak in a anchor right here. See? Whoops. I didn't want to do that. Alright, I am anchored. Which means my boat is safe. Nobody can touch my boat. Nobody can touch my stuff. Um, yeah, I'm going to take everything I've got with me. Uh, try not to end up on that raft, if you would, please. Alright, so I made a discovery. So yeah, if I look at it, uh, the company, uh, company of Narili Vozo is the idiots putting all these freaking things down here. See, they've got, it's a four-day timer, so they haven't been on in six hours. Because there's three days, 18 hours left. Before that becomes available, that you could destroy it. <clears throat> See, they got a shipyard over here. That is a freaking galleon. They're already building a galleon over here. You got that much resources. Why are you... Oh. But, oh my gosh. Okay. So, little lesson for you. That's, um... This is going to be interesting. Um, I... Hmm... <laughs> That's why I have a spyglass. Well, this is kind of convenient. Can I make it? Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, I was going to end the video there for tonight. But we've got a little development here. Wait until you see this. Um, crap. This is going to be very interesting. I'm not prepared for this. I can't make a box. I need my bow and arrow. I need to go level. I have to go level right now. You will see why. Unless someone beats me to it, which could happen. No, don't land on... Oh, my gosh. I almost landed on that raft. That would have pissed me off so bad. Okay, so I need to go find something to kill. Like, really quick. You'll, If you are just tuning in, you might want to stick around for just a little bit. Don't go yet. I can't kill that because he'll fly and then he'll kill me. Yeah, I saw something right off the bat that is going to jump me up a little bit. 
as far as materials. But it won't do me any good if I can't use them. So I need to level. And the best way to do that is just doing stuff. If I can find some easy to kill, it's even better. I mean, I'm getting experience just by running around. There's a rabbit. Ah, you son of a bitch. Ha! One shot, rabbit. Come on, I need to... Alright, something else to kill. Come on. And I'm starving. Screw you. You freaking kill me now, I'm gonna be pissed. Come on, I need to find something to kill. I'm gonna turn the game up a little bit so I can actually see. I don't want to chop too much stuff because I don't have a lot of... There's another rabbit. Ah, oh, damn it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm dying. I'm dying. I know I'm dying. Oof. Stay still. Gotcha. Oh, almost level. I need this level. Come on. I'm going to get this level before I die. Because I'm going to die. Okay, I'm going to show you what I saw. Um, I don't have my spyglass on me because I, I dropped it. <laughs> so let's go down here. <clears throat> this is why I build a, I make a spyglass as fast as I can. Usually I don't run into crystal that fast. If I come over here. See that where it says demolish allowed? That means they have not been here. And I can tear that down. And when I tear that down, that entire galleon that they've been working on is going to come down with it. Which means all the materials, all the wood that is in that is mine. But I got to be able to carry it. And I can't carry it unless I have boxes and storage. So, and I have to respect to do that. If they've got any kind of stuff inside, because you can build the ship dock and then you put stuff in it to build with it. You know what I mean? Uh, so if there's anything in there, it's mine too. So I, I want to tear this down. Oh, is that their base? Oh my gosh. I can't jump. I can't jump. Oh my gosh. 
I just hit like the jackpot. There's gonna be so much stuff up here. Watch. There's water barrels. Oh, I can get in here. This is all mine. Oh, but I need to level. Okay. Okay. Suicide. Okay. We're good. I did it on purpose. So I can spawn at my bed. But oh my gosh, I need to level so bad right now. Okay. Uh, see right there? That's where my body is. That light will show me where my body is, so. I can't believe nobody has gotten that. I just, I. There's not much I can do until I level, though. Oh, I'm so close. I did level. Get up there. So here's what we're gonna do. Do I have to respect or can I? Our storage box. Oh yeah. So now I can make the large storage box. And that's what I need because I need to store all this stuff well. <laughs> A lot of this stuff I'm not gonna be able to use until I can level. So I might have to make myself a makeshift base. Okay. But I don't want to destroy anything until I have stuff prepared, you know, storage-wise. I'm just super amazed this stuff is still here. Put my clothes on. Drop this stuff. Um, large storage box. Thatch and fiber. I need thatches and thatches. Did I level up again? No! Son of a bitch. I hate this freaking mechanic. So they did this to stop people from griefing other people, um, over weighing their ships and, and sinking them. But it's a stupid solution. I don't think I can make a grapple hook. No, I don't know that yet. So I'm going to try. I can't believe this. I gotta be quick. Hopefully it's all here. You only got like two minutes. So hopefully I dropped it all where I can get to it. Damn it. I 
Oh, look at that. See? That worked out perfect. It's all my stuff. See? Look at that. Except for my clothes. I did not take my clothes off. So I don't have any clothes. Oh well. That's okay. I'm thinking I'm going to have plenty of materials here in a second. I'm going to have more wood than I even know what to do with. To be honest with you. I, I'm not going to need all this stuff. But we're going to go up here and we're going to see what we can find. not fall off this time. They got a lot of stuff in here, so... So see the chest I can't break, but the floors I can. You break the floor, you break the chest. I don't make the rules. Wow. Look at all the fiber. Um thatch. I need to find some thatch so I can make some boxes. Look at all those bolos, they're trying to tame. got here wood a lot of this stuff I'll come back for as soon as I can but I need to make boxes first blueprints thatch that's fiber dang I need thatch give me some thatch I can go get some myself Where'd my, oh man, that's right, <laughs> I don't think I'm going to have a problem. I think you guys get the idea of the game. Not gonna bore y'all. Uh, thank you very much for sticking around and watching. I appreciate it. Um, I'm gonna try to do more of these. Um, try to get some more of these done, and uh, that'll be it for tonight. So, again, thanks for watching. I appreciate it, and uh, be cool to one another. Bye.